the awakening simply means that you're not living in a dream world anymore because the normal world is the dream world it's you know where you're thinking of the future past everything is filtered through your ego and you know your life goes by it's a dream when you start awakening to this in waking dreaming and sleeping you move into higher states of consciousness most people will go through lifetimes a lifetime in three states of consciousness waking dreaming sleeping and then they're dead but then there's a fourth domain of consciousness which is called the soul soul consciousness which means in the midst of the observation you stop and you pay your attention to who's observing so i'm observing you now but if i observe and you can try this yourself and anybody who's watching us can try them it themselves as they're looking at us they should just see who's looking and they get a feeling there's a presence here okay even though you can't locate the presence because it's non local it's not in the physical world it's not in the mental world because mental world is thought emotions ego this is the formless void where the observer is you pay attention to this observer you'll see that it's fully awake all the time it's the one that's making it possible for you to have thoughts feelings emotions desires physical body but you pay attention to it to it means to yourself to your most primordial infinite formless self it starts to wake up in waking dreaming and sleeping this in many spiritual traditions is called cosmic consciousness cosmic consciousness because now you're living in two worlds physical and subtle on this side of the fence and on that side of the fence the formless void as the christian theologians say you're in the world and not of it or i think there's an analogy in the new testament where jesus speaks of the lamp at the door inside and outside okay this is cosmic consciousness where the alert witnessing awareness within you is fully awake in waking dreaming and sleeping so you have access to this akashic field insight intuition creativity imagination dormant potentials looking at the future the past precognition um, dreams that come true desires that come true synchronicity remote viewing healing uh, talking to the people who are no longer in local but who have uh, uh, presumably dwelling in non local before they recycle etc these are legitimate experiences and now we need to validate them objectively are the brain waves different is the biology different that's called cosmic consciousness but if you abide in that then you start seeing that the same consciousness is in the objects of your perception 